assalamu alaikum welcome to medicine by chips so today we are performing experiment to check the sensory system of the subject for this purpose first of all we will take consent from the subject assalamu alaikum um, my name is dr alina so i am uh, to i am checking your sensory sensations so can we proceed yes thank you so much so first of all we will uh, perform pain testing for this purpose we will use a pin and uh, we will ask the subject to uh, we will touch the pin at the uh, different dermatomes of the uh, subject for, for this purpose we are first performing this experiment on the upper limb then after this we will perform it on the lower limb so i will touch the pin at your uh, right side then after this we will touch the same we will i will perform the same experiment on the opposite side so first of all you should close your eyes okay when you feel the sensation you will uh, raise your hand and say yes you are feeling it Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Now we are we are moving to the next step for the uh, which is temperature testing. For this purpose, we are using uh, two test tube. One is hot water containing test tube, and the other one is cold water containing test tube. So for hot water it should be about forty to forty five degrees, and for cold water it should be about five to ten degrees. So for this purpose we are here using a wooden spatula. Here, here we are using the wooden sticks. So one is hot of hot water. Are you feeling the sensation? And one is of cold water. Are you feeling the sensation? Okay, thank you so much. So after that we are moving to our next step, which is vibration testing. for vibration testing we will use a tuning fork of 128 hertz so first of all we will take the tuning fork and strike it on our hypothenar space when it is set on uh, vibration then we will place the tuning fork on the distal interphalangeal joint of the subject okay when uh, i will place the place the tuning fork on your distal interphalangeal joint and you will stop feeling the vibration then you will tell that you have stopped feeling the vibration Okay, so we are using this at this moment. So, have you stopped feeling the sensation? Okay. So, if uh, the patient is not uh, feeling the sensation at the distal interphalangeal joint, you will use the uh, ulnar process of the ulnar process of the wrist joint or the olecranon process of the elbow joint of the subject. So, next uh, we are moving to the position of proprioception testing. For this purpose, uh, you will ask the patient to close your eyes. then i will move your finger upside or down okay so when we i will move up you will tell me it is whether up or down or when i will move down you will samely uh, tell me what what is what is the position okay is it up or down up is it up or down down thank you so much so moving on to the next step which is uh, light touch sensation for this purpose we will use a wasp of the cotton wool and same is the process like pain testing we will touch the wasp of the cotton wool at different dermatomes simultaneously on the opposite side also so this is the cotton wool you uh, close your eyes and uh, raise your hand when you feel the sensation okay 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 thank you so much so after that we are moving to the next step which is two point discrimination testing for this purpose we should use a two point discriminator or a compass you can use so uh, at this moment i am using two pencils so i will place two pencils on the pulp of the fingertip and if you can discriminate as two different points tell me are you discriminating them as two different points close your eyes do you feel the discrimination as two points thank you so much so after that we will move to our next step which is stereognosis for this purpose i will place a familial object in your hand and uh, ask you to close your eyes and you will guess what the object is so for this purpose close your eyes okay open your finger hand so what do you feel in your hand what is this 
marker okay very good next is the dysesthesia for this purpose again close your eyes and again i will draw something on your hand and you will tell what the letter is what the letter is b okay very good so this is from the sensory system of the upper limb so now we are moving to the sensory system of the lower limb so again we will perform the same series of test on the lower limb so for this purpose first of all i am doing the same test pain testing in which we use a prick or needle so for this purpose again start for bird dafa okay so i will touch this pain on your one side and then on the other side and when you feel sensation you may raise your hand close your eyes okay okay thank you so much so now moving on to the next step which is the uh, temperature testing again for this purpose we are using two test tube likewise in uh, the upper limb so one is hot water test tube another one is the cold water test tube we will touch these steps test tubes at the patient's lower limb and uh, ask her him to close his eyes and uh, he will tell whether the test tube is hot or cold so after this uh, we are moving to our next step which is uh, vibration testing and again we are using the uh, tuning fork so we will vibrate the tuning fork on our hypothenar space and then place it on the ankle joint of the subject so you uh, you should close your eyes and uh, when i place the uh, tuning fork on the ankle joint and when the vibration stop you should raise your hand okay then uh, we will perform the same uh, test on the opposite side okay now moving on to the next step which is uh, uh, light touch testing for this purpose we will use a wisp of the cotton wool and again like pain testing we will place it on one side do you feel any sensation do you feel a sensation of touch okay then on the opposite side do you feel on uh, any sensation okay thank you so much okay so after this we are performing the position or proprioception testing for this purpose we are using the distal interpharyngeal joint of the thumb of the subject and i will move it upside down so while closing your eyes you may tell that whether it is up or down it is up or down up okay down okay so after that we are moving to our last step which is two point discrimination testing for again for this purpose you should use a two point discriminator and or any blunt object so we are using the pulp of the thumb for this purpose and when you feel two separated points you uh, tell do you feel any sensation as two points okay thank you so much so this is all from the sensory system thank you for watching if you have any queries you can ask subscribe to our youtube channel and share with your friends thank you for watching allah hafiz